Floss Tube family. My name is Becca and this is Sam Bree Stitches and this is going to be my Thanksgiving decor tour. So I hope you enjoy. All right, I apologize if you hear the dogs barking outside. I put them outside so I could record this. So this is my first section, mostly Ray Dunn. I had to find the thankful candle. I love that. It's a pie slice. And then the mug, and then of course the adorable gnome thankful turkey. <clears throat> and he has a pie and turkey feathers. He's so cute. And then my cross stitch piece is a Brenda Gervais piece. I stitched this last year. Um, I'm not really much of a bow person anymore, but I just left the bow on and just finished it in a hoop. So it's pretty cute, just hangs there. And so that is my first section. My next section is kind of the give thanks, thankful, grateful, blessed section. Mostly Ray Dunn again. Sorry for the shadows. I can't get the lighting right. <laughs> but this is all the Ray Dunn. And then this cross stitch piece is a Cherry Hill stitchery piece. And the finishing board is from April, who is Homestead Needleworks. So let me see if I can get in there. There you go. The Grateful by Cherry Hill Stitchery. Love it. And then I put the words and the pumpkins. These things are from Target Dollar Spot last year. I stuck some leaves on there. And so I've discovered that I do need more Thanksgiving stitched pieces. I did pretty well on the Ray Dunn this year. This section doesn't have any stitched pieces in it, but I love it. I got lucky and found that cornucopia, which is Ray Dunn, and the Oh My Gourd. And I love the topper on that, and it's green. So, yeah, so this is my section. I just need um, a stitch piece for this. So those are behind the door. And then we go around here to the bottom. And this is my favorite Thanksgiving piece that I've stitched. And it's another Cherry Hill Stitchery. And y'all might have just seen it in my latest video. Um, but look at that. I just love it so much. Called Four Colors, um, 18 Count Ada, and I can't remember the fabric name, but I listed it in my video and on my Instagram. But this is such a beautiful, beautiful pattern. Cherry Hill Stitchery patterns, I, I love. That she's one of my favorite designers. And then I have a tiered tray that I found at the Target Dollar Spot. And there's a little Beast Cornu in there. This was my first one. I cannot remember who the designer is. I don't think it's Tiny Modernist. Um, I'm not 100% sure. But I love those turkeys. So, and these turkey candle holders, I found at Goodwill. And they're just, they hold little tea lights and they're adorable. So, there is that one. And then we go up to my turkey section. I love this section. It's very busy because it's got a couple giant turkeys in there. Um, but I've got the sign. This is one of my favorite things. I want to say I got it from the dollar store, Dollar Tree last year. Um, but I am not 100%. And then this glorious sparkly turkey was from uh, TJ Maxx, I think. And then Ray Dunn Gobble, another wooden turkey back there. Turkey Time, this is a freebie from Erica Michaels. I believe you have to dig in her uh, blog, I think. Um, it's on Ada. Those little gobbles are supposed to be over one and I just backstitched them. And I filled it with some lizard litter. And it sits on a Ray Dunn uh, like a gravy, a gravy cup or something, but it was just so cute. So that's my turkey section. And then up here is my happy Thanksgiving. Love it. 
This is part of a trio. You've seen the other two, I believe. This is the, um, I want to say it's like the Autumn Trios or something by Waxing Moon Designs. Um, more Ray Dunn. There's Ray Dunn. Give thanks. I don't remember where I got that from. Maybe the Dollar Tree? I'm not 100% sure. And then this tiered tray was also found in the Target Dollar Spot. That turkey candle right there, I found at Goodwill. And I love it. And then just a whole bunch of little gourds and pumpkins. So that's that section. Oops, got blurry. There we go. And then we go over here. And this piece I love. If you watched my latest video, you also saw this. Um, Autumn Beauties. This was a stitch along that I was invited to participate in with Fat Quarter Shop. Um, and I love it. Um, this frame. I got a Goodwill. Trying to, there you go. I just love just the detail on it. Um, the mat did come with the frame. I had to cut it a little bit bigger so that it, you know, didn't cover up the plaid border on this, but I love it so much. So that's finished. I made this rag garland last year. I failed this year. I haven't made any rag garlands. I've just been stitching like crazy. And then I have a Ray Dunn blanket. It says thankful with the blue pumpkins. And then you get all the way to the bottom and there's just a little display down here. I got that Give Thanks tin from Michaels. That wagon's from the Target Dollar Spot and that's another acorn from um, the Ray Dunn pack that I got. So go back up and we'll go over here. And I didn't get my wool applique penny mat done. I bought a kit for it and I just didn't get it done. So I did this instead. Um, thankful, I believe that this was a freebie from Hands On Design last year. And I just stitched it up and stuck it on a magnet. And I got this barn, I think at Lowe's or something last year. And then this gumball machine is actually from Hobby Lobby. And it's just filled with a whole bunch of gourds and pumpkins. So I, I really like this. And then you go up. And this is my, also my favorite. The Glorious Birds. And this is by Lindy Stitches. Love it. Um, I left off the border and I did a flat fold finish. You saw this in my latest video. This is on 18 count princess from Be Stitch Me. And I, I'm just, I'm in love with it. The birds are just glorious. I think in, in Stephanie's Facebook group, somebody voted that she should be like the turkey queen or something like that. So totally agree. And then just this little display, the give thanks was from like the Target dollar spot, I think. And the gathers a Ray Dunn pumpkin. And then the very top, more Ray Dunn. That owl gather is a candle. And I got the fox and the polar bear as well. It was a set of three, so it was so cute. But yeah, so this is my display. I hope that you all enjoyed it. And um, if you have questions on like the fabric or anything like that, you could usually check my Instagram or um, my last video or just leave a comment and I'll, I'll answer it. So thanks so much for watching. Happy Thanksgiving, everybody.